body pan with normalized cloth and it's giveaway time yay I'm excited to be able to bring you this $25 gift card giveaway for baby boo diapers as a lot of you know from a previous video or two I have been brand repping for them now I was introduced to the baby boo brand by store repping for Panelino Bambino and it was this print and this diaper which introduced me to baby boo I will also admit I have a daughter who when she was a baby I nicknamed her baby boo baby boo look at your wild hair She's so big now, but she was my first cloth diapered baby. Mwah! Are you my baby boo? So naturally the name kind of tickled me, but the print really sold me. So I gave it a try. I fell in love with this diaper and so of course I had to get more. And I also fell in love with all the other products because naturally you try one good product from a brand and you get curious about the other products as well. And then when I saw that Thea was looking for brand reps, I had to apply because I fell head over heels in love with the brand and it's incredible. So I want to show you some of the products that I have, what it is that I like about them, and then I will give you more information on that giveaway. So the product that brought me to Baby Boo Diapers, of course, like I said, was the Choice All In Two Diaper. If you ask me, this diaper is definitely more of a, of a pocket style diaper. So the outside has the three snaps on each tab with overlapping snaps. It has the three by three rise settings. So I'm on the middle setting for Holtwood now. And inside you have a pocket in the back. This part's not elasticized, but of course the back is. It has a snap there for you to snap in the insert if you'd like to just snap it and lay it right in, which you can do. I'm not usually a huge fan of all in twos. I don't typically use them. I prefer stuffing my diapers. And if you prefer stuffing your diapers, it's another reason why you're going to absolutely love this diaper, which again, it's really more of a pocket style in my opinion because I use it for that purpose, but you don't have to. It has this front flap with, you know, access to the inside again. Now, every single time I have put this in the washer, the insert agitates out. Frankly, I don't mind unstuffing pocket diapers. I know there are a lot of people out there who really loathe it with a passion. I personally never usually have much problem with just walking the diaper to the pail and as I'm doing it, I usually pinch the front and pinch the insert on the inside and literally just pull them apart and drop them in in one smooth motion. But using these diapers has really spoiled me. The jersey material reduces friction and I think that's part of why it agitates out so well. By the way, stuffing these diapers is pretty easy because the pocket's nice and roomy, which means if you wanna stuff plenty of absorbency in there, there's the room to do so too. Another reason why I like it. I don't have to unstuff them, but just generally the diaper fits really well, the pocket is roomy, it's easy to stuff, the inserts actually agitate out. That jersey material Material, mad easy to spray poop off of. It doesn't cling to it like it does a lot of the suede liners. So I really like this jersey material. I actually liked it more than I thought I was going to. The insert that you can get, you can get just the shell if you have your own preference of inserts, but this can snap in and it can snap down to adjust. And it's surprisingly absorbent, actually. It's very trim and I don't need anything else for this for Holtwood. This works just well on its own. So if you're in the market for pocket diapers where the insert agitates out, where the liner is easy to clean off and that fits your baby really well, you're probably gonna really love this diaper. Moving right along, she has her petite and one size flex cover. So the way the petite and the one size work is reminiscent to me a lot of the Thirsty size one and size two duo wraps, where the size two fits a really wide range, kind of like a generic one size weight range but the size one fits from basically birth until about 18 ish pounds give or take it depends on your baby so the petite cover has two rows of snaps in the hips two by three rise snaps so you can get this diaper pretty small because it also has the crossover tabs so if you snap this on the bottom setting you can actually get that pretty small so even though this diaper is has a snap in there and is designed that you can use this as an all-in-two cover if you want same with the front underneath the flap it's roomy enough in the crotch that you can put this over top a pre-fold or flat and you don't have that poking out near the legs these are also double gusseted covers and double PUL that makes these covers my favorite option for overnight. One thing I also especially love about the petite cover is the fact that it only has the two snaps there, not that third hip snap. You can actually snap those snaps all the way to the very outer edges. So I can actually still get this to fit Holtwood. And he's probably 
at least 18 pounds now. And this still fits him, just on the very last setting. I really wish I could have gotten this on him as a newborn, I really do. As far as the one size cover goes, this one does have that hip snap, which is actually very useful. I've said it before, I'm gonna say it again because it's really the best way to describe this cover. If you are familiar with a Buttons Super Cover and the Diaper Right One Size Cover, this is the love child. You have the double PUL, you have the three snaps on the tab, you have a flap, on the front, but not the back. Now, personally, I never use the back flap. I do sometimes use the front, but never the back. And so for me, this is actually like, oh! You got the two rows of snaps at the top. You have, this is a three by three rise setting. This one's on the middle setting for Holtwood. It's nice and roomy and wide in the crotch. It has double gussets, of course. And this one as well has the snap in the front and in the back if you want to snap in your inserts and use this as an all-in-two cover. So my favorite features about these, double PUL. That's a huge selling factor for me because I use covers mostly for overnights. I hate back flaps because it always seems like your kid has to poop when they're in the cover and then somehow the poop gets on the cover, especially if you're the kind of person that likes to just fold things into a rectangle, which I do a lot if I ever use the covers during the day, which I do sometimes. And it seems like poop will always go into that flap and get stuck in there and ugh. Also this print is so pretty. I love all her prints. Moving on, some, a product that I fell in love with that actually really surprised me and shout out to Brie who sent me this product for free during my store wrapping days because I really probably would have never bought it otherwise, the changing mat. I'm just not usually a changing mat fan. They can be pretty rigid or just bulky or just annoying or ridiculously small. This is a sizable changing mat. It rolls up pretty compact. I can slide it right into the side of my diaper bag and it's easy access in and out. It's pretty darn roomy. And the back side has bamboo. I can't even begin to list all the things I can use this for. I've used this to cover my car seat. I've used this as a sort of makeshift blanket or a windbreaker. I've used this to wipe up spit up. I've used this obviously as a changing mat. I've used this to cover the cloth on my chairs to protect my chairs because dummy me bought chairs that have a cloth seat. What was I thinking? I have kids. I've even used this as a sort of makeshift wet bag when I realized I forgot to put extra wet bags in my bag. I just took the messy diaper and unrolled this and just folded it up. And actually this was a trainer that I couldn't just roll it up and you know snap it shut like I could a diaper. So, and I wrapped it up in this changing mat because I forgot my wet bag. But these changing mats are amazing. I don't think I've ever loved a changing mat before until I met this changing mat. <laughs> it folds up pretty quickly. You just fold it in thirds. I usually fold it almost in half and then just roll it up. And then it just, this wraps right around and snaps to itself. I've, us I've actually done this one-handed quite a few times when I've gone places because I don't always bring the car seat with me to have the baby, to set the baby in when I've done changing him. And so I've, I've rolled this up one-handed quite a few times. And I have a bunch of these now because I am in love with them and I keep them everywhere. <laughs> now, one of the other products I really love Love the bib. You kind of get like the benefit of a wipeable bib because you can just wipe this material clean and use it several times before you have to wash it. But then you also have like the benefits of the com and the comfort of a cloth bib where it's not like rigid and like in the way. It's actually pretty flexible. It's really soft and comfy. It has two snap settings so you can, you know, make the next hole smaller and have it fit your smaller babies or it can fit older kids. I can actually put this on my older kids. It has a crumb catch. I typically feed them in the high chair and generally anything that would have otherwise normally fallen in between their tummies and the tray gets caught in there. So these work actually pretty well for me. And these prints are amazing. Last but certainly not least, the wet dry bag. This is a nice size bag. You can probably fit like eight diapers in here pretty comfortably. And it has two pockets, one on this side and one on this side. Personally, I don't usually use multiple pockets. I could see this being useful if you send your child off to daycare especially, but typically I only use one pocket. But even then, I really love these wet bags because straps! A lot of wet bags come with the one strap, which is okay for most applications. I love the two straps. I can put this on my stove. I can hang this on his crib. I can put this on the stroller. I've hung this on the back of chairs. I have one in my car that I put my Beko baby carrier in so it doesn't get all wet and nasty because if I just lay it in there, my kids with their wet feet will find it. It's happened twice before. And then I finally got the sense to do that. It's just the one particular thing that makes these straps nice is that it keeps your bag level. But the wet bag works really well. I love these. I bought more. My sister stole one. She doesn't even have a baby. <laughs> she was like, what do I need that for? I was like, oh, I love wet bags because they're good at keeping moisture in or out. And she was like, ah. 
Oh, and then she took one. So that's basically the gist of the products, what I really, really like about them. If you like any of these products, you're really gonna love this giveaway because it's a $25 Baby Boo gift card giveaway. All you have to do is click the Rafflecopter link in the description box below. There, you can just sign up with an email address. Make sure you use a valid email address. Email is just for the purpose of this giveaway. It's not to sign up or subscribe to anything in particular. However, you can get bonus entries by subscribing to my channel, by going and checking out the Baby Boo Diapers Facebook page, liking the page, joining the Baby Baby Boo friends group. Go like my normalized cloth page. That's where I'm going to make the winner announcement as well. You can follow me on Instagram and you can follow Baby Boo Diapers on Instagram. All of these things can earn you bonus entries. And of course, I'm going to pile some links into the description box below. Share what your favorite product you've seen here is or what you would love to try and why. What's a really cool feature of any of these products you saw that you like? What what really stood out to you is neat. I think my favorite thing by far has to be this diaper and not just because the print is amazing because I have this print in like everything. I really, really love these products. Again, if you want to give them a try, you can find them at babyboodiapers.com. I'm also going to link a bunch of other retailers that you can find them at if you have a preferred retailer. But if you go to Baby Boo Diapers, you can use the code HOLT10 and save yourself some money as well. And that code is good through March. Go check out that Rafflecopter. Links in the description box. Subscribe if you want to see more giveaways and more videos about cloth diapering. Thank you for watching and have a blessed day.